Hey guys, Heidi and Casey here with you, Simple Fitness today. Such a beautiful day, we're taking it outside. We have a full body workout for you. It's gonna be approximately 40 minutes. You're going to do a strength component, which is about five minutes long, followed by a cardio Tabata for four minutes, followed by one minute of core work. Then you'll have a 60 second recovery and we're gonna go through it again. We have four circuits for you to follow. All right, so it's time to get warmed up. We're going to start with our feet nice and wide. Toes angled out around 45 degrees. We're going to drop down right into a sumo squat. Just drop down and lift up. Just getting those hips going and lift, yeah. Now when we're doing the strength portion of this workout, we're going to stay with the same movement, but we're going to add all different kinds of variation with the speed. So if at any time it starts to get too challenging, just set the weights down. Continue on without it, all right? Hold down. Now we're going to add the arms. Lift up, press down. Lift, press. Ah, you got it. Nice deep cleansing breaths in. As always, right here, set your intentions for your workout. What are you looking for? What do you want? Take yourself to that point of being uncomfortable and know that that's where you're changing. The big difference between being uncomfortable and being in pain. Never pain. Always know that what you're feeling is because you're working. One more. Hold at the bottom. Arms are going to come out to the front. Back, front. Just open up that chest. Perfect. All the while, bringing that oxygen in, nice deep cleansing breaths. Disperse it through, two more. One, and two, perfect. We're gonna take one hand, we're gonna reach right down, we're gonna lift up, and just come over, nice side extension. And up and over to the other side. Side extension. Nice, right up to the top, those feet are gonna come together. We're gonna drop right into an air squat. Drop down, lift up. Sitting your weight back, pressing through your heels. Perfect, as we go through this warm up, you're going to see a lot of the moves you're gonna see in the workout. The best warm up is any warm up that previews what you're gonna do. You got it. So when you get to the moves, you're familiar with it. Perfect. One, two more, two, and one. Bring it up. We're going to start with a knee lift. Now, if you want, you can come into high knees here. I'm going to stay low impact. Casey's going to bring it up to high knees. Yeah, you got it. Let that heart rate start to come up. If you're low impact, you can... Stay with your feet grounded. You can lift your arms up and down. Four more seconds. One, two, three, and four. Step touch, step touch. We're previewing a little bit of what you're gonna see in the Tabata. Now we're gonna go two times. One, two, perfect, one. Now if you don't have the space, stay with the single step touch. And we're going to turn this, Casey, you have space. We're going to turn this into a shuffle. One, two, three, four, back. You got it. Come on. Now make sure you pick the feet up on the shuffle so you don't trip, especially if you're working on carpet right there. Two more. Here's one. Here's two. Right back, center, high knees, high knees, high knees, high knees. You got it. Lift, 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 lift. Four, three, two, jumping jacks. Go. Perfect. Yes, you always have an option. Any movement is good movement. So you know what you can do. Get out of your comfort zone and push yourself to the next level. Be aware of how you're feeling. Last four, three, two, and one. March it out. Woo! You got it. You did those high knees. 
doing so well. You're right there. All right, team. So we're going to start with the first circuit. Our weighted portion is first. If you have dumbbells, you're going to use them. If not, you can use anything you have in your house. Bottles of water, bigger water bottles that you can fill, cans of soup, bottles of wine, laundry detergent, we've seen it all. All right, this first move we're gonna do is a deadlift. So you have a nice soft bend in the knee. You don't wanna keep those legs straight. We're gonna drop down towards the floor. You go as low as you can before you feel the need to round your back. Chest stays open. We're gonna pull up to the top and we're gonna do an upright row. Single counts, ready, here we go. Down, beautiful, up, lift, down. Squeezing the back side. Nice, right into your glutes. You should be feeling a nice stretch through your hamstrings. Pulling all the way up into your shoulders. Your hands, elbows, and wrists make one straight line. Watch when Casey comes up. She's one straight line. She doesn't have those elbows up by her ears. Nice, working right in the calf of the shoulder. One more, we're just gonna change the speed. Down for two, it's down. Two, up, two. You got it, slow and controlled. Up. Always remembering the slower you go through the motion, the more muscle fiber you bring into the move. The more you work, it's that simple. We're gonna get four more. When we add speed, we add momentum, which makes it easier. One more. Speed change coming up. Down one, up three. Drop, lift, lift, lift. Beautiful, drop, lift, lift, lift. You got it, come on, drop, lift, lift, lift. Let's go. One more, down for three. Lower, 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 pull up quick. Nice, lower, 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 pull up quick. Two more, lower. Lower, lower, pull up quick. One more. Beautiful, up. Now we're gonna hold halfway down. Right here, we're just gonna lift up an inch, down an inch. Up, using your buttocks and your hamstrings. If you are feeling this at all in your lower back, readjust yourself, four more. One, two, three, all the way up, those upright rows come up and pulse up, up, up. So this count phrase that we did for this one exercise is going to be what we do for all of them. So now you're familiar, four, three, two, one. We're gonna bring those hands all the way up to the top. Second exercise, tricep extension. We're gonna drop back, lift. This one is gonna to get tough, Whew. right up, right up. So always, always remember what we say, right? We call it simple fitness for a reason. It's not complex. It's simple basic moves that you determine the intensity of. Right there, hold at the top, down for two. It's down, down, up, up, perfect, down. And then recognize when the weights get too heavy, you set them down and continue without it. Right up, down, down, up, up, good, down, down, up, we have two more, how are you doing Casey? Down. Feeling it, feeling it, all right, let's go, down, down for three, up one, and down, two, three, lift, down, two, three, lift, you got it, down, two, three, lift, down, Ooh. two, now just the opposite, down, one, up, three, and down. Woo, hello, ah. triceps, down, yeah, you got it, come on, we're almost there. Oh, all we have left, are you ready? Is 
that pulse. Ooh. Hold, pulse, come on. Woo. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Bring it up, bring it in. Back to the deadlifts. Down, upright row. Beautiful. Now you know it. Now we're going to roll through it. Perfect. Feel what you want. See what you want. Create what you want. Casey, what are your goals? Summer arms. Yeah. <laughs> two more. One. Two. Slow it down. Down. Two. Squeeze up. Yeah. So if arms are your goals, every time you pull up, treat every one like it's the only one you're going to do and feel the change happening. We have four more, just like that. Beautiful. I never thought I'd hear myself say, I can't wait to get to the Tabata. Let's go. One more. Down, one, up, three. Down, up, two, three. Down, up, two, three. Down. Now, you can see, beautiful. I'm pretty flexible in my hamstrings, so I'm able to get down. One more. Now down three, up one. Down, two, three, lift. Down, two, three. But if your hamstrings are tight, you may only make it to your knees. That is fine. Right there, there's a modification. Pull up two more. Last one. Hold down at the bottom. Little inch up, inch down. Inch up. Mark it on your legs so you know where you're going. You hit it every time. Four, three, two, and one. Bring it all the way up. Pulse, pulse into the shoulder. Relax your hands. Feel those shoulders talking to you. Woo! Four, three, two, one. We go back overhead. Tricep, drop, down, lift, down, lift, down, lift, down. Perfect. Four, you got it. Hold that belly button in. Three, two, one. Drop to two. Down, down, lift, down. Be very careful about keeping those weights separate. Two more at this count. Down for one, up three. Down, lower, 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 up, down, lift, 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 down, lift, lift. One more here. Down, down three, up one, hang on. Two, three, lift, lower, two, three, almost there, Woo. two more, come on. Now one more, we just have to pulse. Woo! And pulse. One, two, three, four, five, Woo! six, seven, eight. Ah! Woo! Set them down. All right, team, let's give that upper body a little rest. We're gonna just start marching those feet. We're gonna go right into the Tabata. We have two cardio moves, that shuffle and those high knees that you saw in the warm up. We're going to start with a step touch, step touch, and then I'll count us in. Three, two, one, shuffle, shuffle. Come on, shuffle. Don't worry about being on beat with us. Go at your own pace. 20 seconds of work, 10 seconds of recovery. To keep it simple, we're going to do each exercise four rounds. Woo! Come on. Recover. Woo! Woo! Now we learned it. So now ask yourself, how can you make it a little more challenging? Three more rounds of that. You ready? Go. Come on. Now if you're in a smaller space, you can just make your shuffle smaller, just like I'm doing here. Or you can make it bigger with Casey. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Three, two, one. Recover. Woo! Two more rounds. 
two more rounds, 40 seconds of work. You can do it. Three, two, one, go. Come up. And again, if you want to stay totally low impact, you just stay right here. I got this round low impact. Let's hit it. Woo! That heart rate is the goal. Get that heart rate up. Five seconds. Recover. One more set of shuffles. You don't have to see them again. You ready? Five seconds. Three, two, one. Let's go. Come on. Come on. I'm going to mix it all up. Always an option. Whatever you need to get that heart rate going. Your body likes to be tricked and challenged. We have five seconds. Let's go. Three, two, one. Four rounds of high Ooh. knees coming up. 80 seconds of total work. You got it. They're short and sweet and intense. Two, one. High knees. High knees. Go. Come on. Up. 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 Perfect. Lift up. Lift. Beautiful. 10 seconds. Come on. At any time, you can take the arms up. Remember, you want to work a 10 out of 10. Your heart rate Woo. is challenged. Recover. Woo! You want to want to take that 10 second rest. You want to question if you can go again in two seconds. Ready? Go. Come on. Beautiful. Let's go. Come on. Again, all options on the table. High knees. Low impact. You got it. Five seconds. Woo! Be aware of where your core center is. Recover. Let's go. Woo! Get ready. Go. You got it. Last set, right, Case? One more after this. One more. <laughs> I'm so bad at counting. We got it. Come on. I'm hoping there's one more. Or this was it. Let's go. Come on. Three, two, one. Okay. Whew. So this is my unexpected last one. As much and as hard as you can work. Ready to go after it? Let's go. Go. Up. Come on. Come on. Woo. Beautiful. You got it. Lift them up. Lift them up. Lift them up. Up, up. Any way you want. Pick them up. Pick them up. We have five seconds, team. Woo. Three, two, one. Ah. You got it. Here we go, team. Catch your breath. Get a drink of water. We're going to take it down to our mat. We're going to do 60 seconds of a windmill. Now, if your heart rate is still elevated when we start this move, I want you to keep your head up. You're going to roll back. It's going to be 30 seconds on the side. Weight is optional. You can do this with or without. You can see my head is elevated to keep my head above my heart. Extend the arm. We're going to lift, lower, lift. Now, if your heart rate is down, you can drop that head all the way back. Or if you need to, you can place that hand behind and support that neck. You got it. Up. Uh, beautiful. Come on. Almost done with this side. One more. Bring it in right over to the other side. Extend that arm. Lift. Lower. Lift. Again, that weight is optional. It's there for added resistance. You decide how much and what kind of challenge you're up for. You got it, five seconds. Recover. Woo! Woo. You got it, team. That's circuit number one. You have 60 seconds to regroup and join us back in the stand. We're gonna come back to our second phase of strength work. You're gonna have a bicep curl 
with a calf raise. Up. Okay, we'll do a hammer curl with a calf raise. And then we're going to bring the weights up to our shoulders. And we're going to do a squat with a press. Okay? So again, you decide the amount of weight you want to work with, if any at all. Always optional to just add your own resistance to the movement. I like to think about moving my arms through quicksand or through sand or through water. Shoulders back and down. We're going to go in five seconds. And lift. So when you come up to the top of that move, right there, you want to keep your elbows attached to your sides. Sometimes I see people doing this where their elbows swing off, right? You want your arm to stop just where it feels natural. That's the full load into the bicep. Okay. Right up. Right up. One more. Beautiful. We're going to slow it down on a two count. It's up for two. Whoa, you get a little more balance in there, don't you? Up for two, down, two, up, two, perfect, up, two, down, two, up, two, down, up for three, down one, it's up, two, three, lower, up, two, feel that core work? Yeah, you gotta <laughs> feel it, there you go. One more, we'll change direction. Up one, down three. It's up, lower, lower. Yeah, that negative part of the work. Up, lower, lower, lower. Perfect. Up, lower, lower, lower. One more. Up. Yes. Now up and hold. Up and hold. Turn your palms up to the ceiling, and we're just going to pulse, 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 pulse. Squeeze those inner thighs together. You got it. Shoulder blades back and down. Ready? Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Release it down. Perfect. Those weights are coming right up to our shoulders. Squat with a press up to the ceiling. We're going to squat and press. Good. Squat. Press. Squat. You got it. Pushing through the heels. Watching as you squat down that those knees do not shoot way out over those toes. Keep those hips back. You got two more. One, two, we're gonna slow it down. Down for two, up for two, down, two. Now you drop that squat as low as you can, okay? If you have a hip or a knee injury, you modify your range. Right there, perfect. Stopping at 90 degrees. If you can take it deeper, you take it deeper. We have three more. Woo! Yes, one more. Now down one, up three. Down, lift, 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 drop. Lift, 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 drop. When you change the tempo, of the move. Even though you're still doing the same move, your body reacts differently. One more. I think I go too much longer. Here we go. Down three, up one. Down, two, three. Your body reacts differently because the load on the muscle is different. Yeah. You got it. So you can take the same exact exercise and just vary your range. Hold down at the bottom. down, shake them out. Round two coming up. Ready for that bicep curl with the calf raise. Those biceps got a nice rest in that work there. We're going to lift up, down, up, perfect, up, nice, lift, lift, three, two, up for a two count. Slow it down. It's up, up, 
that squeeze. Feel those calves coming up the back of your legs. I know your biceps are talking to you, but don't forget, we're also working our calves. Up, up, lower, lower. Up, up, two more. Up, up, one more. Up, up, up for one, down for three. It's up, lower, lower. Lower, good, up. Wiggle your fingers. Don't have a death grip on those weights. You got it, one more just like that. Up. Up for three, down one. It's up, two, there's the balance. Release, up, two. Yeah, feels good, doesn't it? Woo, this is where you start talking to yourself. Say this, my words, my go-to phrase. Hold up at the top, palms facing up, and pulse is I love this. It feels so good. What else could we be doing right now besides challenging ourselves and making ourselves stronger? Four, three, two, one. Release it down. You got it. Coming right back up to the shoulders. Last set of strength for this round. We're going to drop down, push, down, push, down, push, down. Four more. Two, three, and four, just super slow. Down for two, up for two, perfect. Down, two, up, you got it. Come on, now feel all that strength, everything. As heavy as you can, push up. We have four more, let's go. Down. more. Now fast down, slow up. It's down, up, two, three. That's challenging. Come on. Yes, two more. Woo! One more. Down, slow up, fast. Last set. Up, slow and fast. Last set. Before we pulse. Come on. One more. Down at the bottom, hold. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, all the way up. Pulse, eight, seven, six, Woo. five, four, three, two, one. Woo! Set them down. You guys got to shake it out. We got Tabata, and we have 60 seconds of core. For the Tabata round, you're going to see donkey kicks. You're going to come down, and you're either going to just step over, step over, or you're going to kick up, kick up, followed by jumping jacks, or if you're low impact, you're going to be here, okay? You got it, guys. going to go in five seconds, donkey kicks, as fast as you can for 20 seconds. Go. Over. Come on. Over. Beautiful. Beautiful, you got it, you got it. Let's go, let's go. Woo! Perfect, perfect. You have five seconds. As Casey jumps up, she pulls her belly button into her spine, stabilizes the core, done, recover. Woo! We have three more rounds of those. Feel the strengthening in your shoulders. Nice isometric contraction, ready, go. Over. Over, over, over. You decide how high you want to take these, how fast you want to go. Come on. Push, push. Done. Woo! You got it. 10 seconds recovery. How you doing, Case? That's challenging. Three, two, one, go. 40 seconds of work left. Go after what you want. Recover. Woo! Wow. I like to count why I'm doing Tabata. See how many I get into each round 
and that's how I challenge myself for the next round. Last one, go! cleansing breath. We're going to come up to a stand. We have four rounds of jumping jacks. Ready? High impact, low impact, your choice. Go. Now while you're jumping, hold your body strong. Contract, contract, absorb the landing. Even same thing if you're here, low impact, right? Absorb the landing. Feel the strength in the muscles doing the work. Recover. Woo! got it. 60 seconds of work left. 20, 20, 20. Come on and you'll be halfway done with this workout. You got it right there. And for those of you that are going to leave us halfway, it's your opportunity. Ready? Go. One, woo, two more rounds left. Take a nice deep breath in. If you need a drink, this is the place that you get it. Going again in five seconds. Ready? I'm gonna get fancy on this one. Go, go. I like to just change it up. Woo. So I don't get bored. Anything you want. It's hard to get bored in 20 seconds though, isn't it? Come on, come on, five seconds. Three, two, one, woo, recover, you got it, fire up those shoulders, ready, last round, go, we fired up those shoulders when we did those donkey kicks, keeping them going right here with these arms elevating in the jacks, gonna stay in them on the core series, let's go. Two, one, Woo. recover. Woo! You got it. Here's our core team. We're going to do an inchworm. You're just going to walk yourself out. You're going to pause and then walk yourself slowly back. Hold, out, pause, and back. 60 seconds. If it bothers your wrist, you can hold your plank on your forearms for 60 seconds. Okay? Let's go right here. Rock and roll. You're on. Let's go. Out. Feel your core as you flatten that back. Take it back. If you want to add a little bit more resistance, when we're out here, alternate leg lifts and push back. Perfect. Right out. If you have the room, you can walk your feet in and just inchworm all the way across your apartment. Right there. Your yard, your house. A little over halfway there. Hold. Beautiful. Come on. You got it. Pause. Pull that belly button in. Right there. Right there, let's go. Two different options. You can stay down or you can bring it up like Casey does. Again, it's finding and stretch it back. Woo. Woo. You got it, team. All right, that is halfway through this workout. If for some reason, which I can't imagine why, you'd need to take off now, you got a great full body workout in 30 minutes. Heading on to station number three. Make sure you do stretch if you're leaving. If not, we'll stay right here. We're gonna do a weighted squat right here. Perfect. And come right up to the top, that's all it is. And then the second one is gonna be a sumo squat with a frontal raise. We're gonna drop down and just lift those weights right to the front. If one 
and then the other is more comfortable for you, by all means, you do that, okay? All right. We bring those weights right up to our shoulders. Put them on there comfortably, however you want to hold them. We're not going to move them on this one. We're just going to flip back. Remember, this is a perfect place just to work on that squat form. When you get down to the bottom, make sure those knees stay open. One more. Down for two, up two. Down, two, up two. Sometimes when people squat, their knees have a tendency to come together, right? That is a weakness through the inner thigh. Right there, so you want to focus on keeping your glutes contracted, those knees open. Sometimes that's the main focus for us, right? Focus on your weakness, strengthen it, and then we move on. Down for one, up for three. Down, lift, lift, lift. Down, lift, lift, lift. Perfect. Down, lift. One more, come on. Pretend these weights weigh 100 pounds. Down for three, up one. Down, two, three, lift. Down, two, three, lift. Down, two, three, one more. Down, two, three. Here comes my favorite, ready? Hold at the bottom, and just pulse, pulse. Lift those toes up, lift. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, Woo, bring it up right into that sumo squat. So those feet are going to face out at a nice 45 degree angle. Shoulders back and down. When you come down to the bottom of that sumo squat, your knees go over your ankle, okay? We're going to lift up and do a front raise. Ready? Drop. Drop. Up. Raise. Up. Drop. Squeeze. slow. Down for two, up two, lift up two. Whoa, there's the work. Woo. Down, two, up, two, lift up, lift up, lower, lower. Down, two, up, two, lift, lift. Here's our last one. Down, two, up, two, up, up, down one, up for three. Down, up. One, two, three. Release. Down, up. One, two, three. Release. Down, up. One, two, three. One more. Down, up. Hop, hop, hop. Down three, up one. Down, two, three. Lift, lift, lower. Down, two. Shoulders, just keep the chest open, shoulders back. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Now bring it all the way up. I'm going to change this one a little bit. We're going to alternate one arm, opposite. Go. Up, 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 up. Four more. One, two, three, and four. You got it. Beautiful. Woo. Right into those weighted squats. Ready? Drop. Down. Lift. Down. Lift. Hang on to you when you're doing amazing. Woo! Starting to get really challenging. You're starting to say, when is this going to be over? I know it. <laughs> I got it. Come on. Hold. Down for two. Down. Two. Stay. That's when you have to teach or train yourself. Stay right in the moment. Stay right here. It doesn't matter what happened before. 
this, it doesn't matter what happens after this. You want to stay right here with it, down one, up three. Down, up two, three. Down, up two, three. Down, up two, three. Two more, come on. Lift, lift, lift. One more. Down three, up one. Down two, three. Ah, feel your core. Feel that stabilizing. It's right there, hold at the bottom. And pulse, 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 pulse. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, Ooh. one. Beautiful. Woo! Get ready to make it burn. Last set on this great series. Here we go. Sumo squat. Down, lift, up. Perfect. Woo! as you lift that weight up. Nice, you got it. Now you see Casey doing one arm and then the other. When you start to feel like that challenge is too much for you, alternate arms, last one. Super slow, here we go. Down, two, up, two, up, two, down, two, beautiful, down, two, Two, lift, lift, two more just like that. Down, two, oh, embrace it. Woo. Feel the strength in it. Feel the muscles in your spine running up and down alongside your spine. Right here, down for one, up for three. It's down, lift, one, two, three, release. Feel all those muscles in your back just stabilizing your torso when we know the mover right here is the front of that shoulder, but that core has work to do right there. Now just the opposite, down three, up one, down two, three, lift, lower, down two, three, lift, two more, come on, down two, three, lift, lower, one more, down two, three, lift, Lower, hold down, and pulse, 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 pulse. Four, three, two, bring it up, alternate arms, lift, woo, last set. Lift, put that in your back case. Oh, feel it, strengthening all those stabilizers that run parallel to your spine. Let's go, two more, one, and two, beautiful, you got it, Woo. set it down. Woo. Get a drink, guys, if you need it, coming right into the Tabata. Mountain climbers, and just high jumps. You'll jump as high as you can, okay? Four rounds of mountain climbers, four rounds of high jumps, 60 seconds of core. All right, ready? Get ready, new mountain climbers. Just gonna pull those feet underneath. Five, four, three, two, one, go. Pull them under, pull them under. Now check it out, you got it? The lower you are in a flat plank, the more core you're gonna use underneath. If it starts to bother your lower back at all, you're gonna take your buttocks up a little higher. Okay, you have five seconds. If you're low impact, eliminate the bounce, recover. Woo. I'll do this round low impact. Three, two, one, go. Low impact doesn't mean slow. It just means there's no bounce. Pull them under. 10 seconds. Woo! Keep that head in strike. Nice, nice straight alignment with the spine. Recover. Woo! Two more sets of those. Nice deep breath in. Embrace this recovery. Ready? Go. Pull it in. Pull it in. Remember the point of Tabata is to get that heart rate up there. Increasing your cardiorespiratory fitness, right? Increasing your fitness level all over. Strengthening. Cardio. Flexibility. Three, two, one. Recover. Woo! One more set, one more set, three, two, one, go. You got it, 
come on. Pull it in, pull it in, pull it in, pull it in. Nice. Nice. Woo! Resist the urge to drop your head. Five seconds. Pull it in. Feel those muscles Woo. underneath tight. Recover, stretch back. Beautiful, we're gonna bring it right up. Nice and slow, deep cleansing breaths. We're gonna squat down and jump up and try to touch the ceiling. You got it, go. High jump, high jump. If you want low impact, boom. Squat and lift those knees. Lift, lift, lift. High jump, high jump, high jump. Recover, beautiful. All right, can you stay low impact on this one? You got it, high knees up. I'm gonna go high impact, the best you can, go. How high? How high? Come on. Beautiful. Lift. Don't hold your breath. Catch your breath. Yeah, you got it. Come on. Let's do it. Michael Jordan's got nothing on me. Let's go. Recover. That's how you get yourself to it, right? Think about somebody that motivates you. Think about it. What does that challenge look like for you, right? You don't have to be them. Ready? Go. You just have to do the best that you can. Let's go. All different modifications we're showing you here. Pick the one that challenges you the most. Let's go. Three, Woo. two, one. Woo! Sweating, sweating. One more. One more, right? One more. This is it. Let's go. We're off. Come on. Perfect. Perfect. Let's go. Drop. Reach. Reach. Place something up overhead. See what you want and go after it. Three, two, woo, one. Woo! Finishing up round number three. All right, there's a couple of options here. We're going to do what are called windshield wipers. Legs up to the ceiling. Hands out in goal pose, 90 degree angle. And you're going to drop your legs all the way over to the side. You're going to come up to the center. You're going to drop your feet down. Center. And drop them to the other side. And center. Okay? If the extension is too much for you, you're going to keep your knees bent at 90 degrees. Drop, over, and center. Okay, we do the center position so we give our lower back time to regroup and get ready to go in the opposite direction. 60 seconds, ready? Up, go. Beautiful, drop center. Ooh, I'm on a down go. <laughs> I am too, you got it? Woo! Yeah. Woo. If you're outside working out, Try to find a nice level playing field. You got it. Beautiful, right there. Come on. Focus through those obliques. Pulling that core in. Feeling the connection. Your entire spine makes to that mat when you come back up to the top. Keeping your shoulder blades on the mat so you don't roll your upper torso. Stay grounded. Perfect. We have 15 more seconds. Let's go. Beautiful. Right there. Woo. Release it. Woo, perfect. Just push yourself up into that bridge. Just pushing, opening up to those hip flexors. You have 60 seconds to get ready, team, for your last circuit. And it's so nice because this one. We're gonna stay right down here, okay? We're gonna take that move that we just did. We're gonna bridge up. We're gonna hold those dumbbells up to the ceiling. Now when you bridge up, I want you to squeeze your inner thighs together, your knees, your ankles, push your hips up to the ceiling. You're resting on the back of your shoulders, not your neck. And we're gonna do a set of, they're called flat bench flies. With all that random pattern of counting. The second movement we're gonna come into 
We're going to roll right up, and we're going to do a set of bent over rows. Okay? So stay nice and close to your mat. This is it, guys. Last circuit. Everything you own right up to the top. Feet connect with the ground. We're going to push up into that bridge. Make sure it's a good position. Squeeze the inner thighs, the knees, the ankles. We're going to open and squeeze up. Open and squeeze through the chest. Those weights are right over your chest, not over your face. Right there, beautiful. This one's going to get challenging as well. Right up. Squeeze one more. Slow it down. Down for two. It's down. Two. Engage through the chest. Two. Down. Two. Engage. Two. Now here's the deal. Even though the weights are way out in your hands, the movement comes through your chest. You're going to squeeze through those pecs right up. Let's get two more. If you just saw my weight roll away, you see what kind of incline I'm working on. <laughs> right there, two more. Down, two. One more on this count. Now down for one, up for three. It's down, lower, up, up, release. Release, you got it. Up, squeeze. Oh, that chest feels good, right? Right up, two, up, up one, down three. It's up, lower, lower. Which one do you think is more challenging? When you go slower up or slower down? Yeah, you got it. What about you, Chase? Down. Up, up, up. Now hold at the bottom. From the chest, just pulse. Pulse, pulse, pulse. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Woo. Bring them up. Beautiful. Roll it in. Woo. And nice and slowly, we're going to get up. There goes my weight. <laughs> we're going to roll over. And we're going to come right up. Slow and steady. Shoulders back and down. We're going to hinge forward into that bent over row. We keep our knees bent. Head is a nice straight line with the spine. We're going to lift up. Release. Up. Release. Squeezing into your back like you're squeezing the golf ball. And every time those weights come up, pull your belly button up into your spine. In. Two more. One. Two. Up for two. Down two. Up. Two. Down. Perfect. Now you're going to feel a lot more going on here than just your back. Beautiful. Your glutes are going to start to burn. Your butt's going to burn. Your quads, your hamstrings. Feel all that stabilizing. You got it. Up. Two. Down. Two. Up. Two. Up. One. Down. Three. Up. Lower. 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 Lift. Lower. 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 Lift. There. Good. Down slow. Down. We just did that one. Let's reverse it. Ready? Beautiful. Down one up three. Down. Lift. 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 Down. Lift. 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 Good. My legs are burning. Come on. Squeeze into the shoulder blades. Good. You got it. Lift. 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 Last one. Hold at the top and pulse. Just the shoulder blades. Just the shoulder blades. Lift, 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 lift. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Woo! Woo! Whoa. Feel those glutes right back down. Last set. Last set of weights right here, guys. Almost there. So beautiful. We're going to push up into that bridge. Those arms are going to come up. We're going to drop out, lift, out, Woo. lift, beautiful, out, right? You're feeling this in your butt? Squeeze those knees, squeeze those inner thighs together. Beautiful. 
pretend you have a ball right in between your inner thighs and you just kind of hold it there. Two more. One. And two. Slow it down. Down. Two. Up. Two. Down. Two. Up. Let's go. Come on. Breathe into that chest, the front of your arms, wiggle your fingers, don't squeeze those weights. Hold up at the top, down one, up three, down, up, two, three, let's go, up, two, three, watch those hips, I just found myself letting my hips drop out, pull them back up, now the other way, down three, two, one, lift, three, two, one, lift, three, two, one, last one, hold at the bottom, and pulse with the chest, with the chest, like you're sweeping a golf ball, right in the middle of your sternum, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, Woo. Woo. bring it up, here comes that butt again, right? With, nice and slowly, you're gonna get up. Sometimes when we go from being down to getting up, we can get a little lightheaded. So take a moment, right? And let yourself recoup. Here we go, right here, team. Last set of weights, drop forward, tighten up the glutes. Right here, we're gonna lift. Up, up, up. Beautiful, four more. Two. Four, slow it down, up, two, down, two, squeeze up, two, down, see what you want, feel it, come on, up, you got it, focusing all the work into your back, into your back, up, up, nice, let's go, up, 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 one, down, three, up, lower, 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 lift. Slow, up, two, three, release, up, two, three, release, up, two, three, release. One more, hold up at the top, and just pulse, 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 eight more, eight, seven, sit deeper to that squat, four, three, two, one, Woo! release it. All right, team, here we go. Almost there, last set of Tabata. We're going to stay upright. We're just gonna go from fast feet to your old fashioned twist and shout, okay? That's it, four rounds, four rounds, finish up with our last bit of core. Ready, fast feet, go. Just fast feet, it's up to you, come on, come on. Beautiful, if you wanna get a little fancy, you can turn it to the right, you can turn it to the left. You got it, hang on, come on. Five seconds, three, two, one. Beautiful, recover. Now the deal when you're doing fast feet is not to let everything else in your body shake, right? You wanna contract in tight, feel the strength. Two, one, go. Come on. Beautiful, let's go. Let's go, come on. Come on, come on. Hold the core solid, shoulders open, chest is tall, right there. Woo! Feel the legs talking to you, make them burn, recover. Got it. Two more sets of that. Almost there. It's perfect. You got it. Let's go. Come on. Right there. Beautiful. Nice. Hold on. Hold on. It's like running on hot coals. How quickly you can lift those feet up. You got it. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Five seconds. Woo. Recover. Oh. One more. One more. Beautiful. You guys are amazing. Whew. Some of us stepped way out, go of our comfort zone today. Let's do it. Let's do it. We are right there. Come on. Beautiful. That's 10 seconds. Yeah, hang on. Hang on. Three, two, one. Whoa. Recover. Woo! You got it? Last set we're going to do right here. Twist it out. Four sets of twist. Ready? Go. 
Come on. Right? Feel the rotation through the waist. Feel the rotation. You got it. Come on. Press. 10 seconds. Woo! And recover. Woo! We got it. Yeah, this can move, right? Everything in the middle. Feel the rotation. It's like you're wringing out a rag of water. Ready? Three, two, one, go. Now arms up if you want, right? You can make it harder. Whoa, feel that rotation. You got it. Bring them down. Bring them down. Wherever you want. On your hips. Whatever feels best for you. Keep those feet together. Halfway there. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Three, two, one. You got it right there, team. We have two more. 40 seconds of work. It's right here. Ready? Go. Come on. Come on. Make them your best ones. Best ones yet. Every muscle in your core center right now. Front, side, and back. Working for you. You got five seconds. Let's do it. Come on. Three. Two, what? This is tough. This is tough. This is tough. Right here. Last one. Ready? Come on, you can do it. This is it. One more set of abs, and we are out of here. Going in three, two, one. Go. Come on. Go. 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 Come on. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. We know. Let's do it. Way more coordinated than I am. You got ten seconds. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Woo! Every muscle. Firing up the lats. Woo, ready? Three, oh, two, one. Woo! Yeah. You guys got a team. All right. Let's hit it. Staying tried and true. Basic, simple, right here. Because our heart rate's elevated even more, we're going to take our hands right across our chest. We're going to roll back until we feel those shoulder blades hit the mat. And then we're going to bring it right back up to the top, okay? If you want to get a little more challenge, we're going to lift up one knee and just add a slight rotation. 60 seconds. Ready? Go. Come on. Beautiful. Inhale on the way back. Exhale on the way up. You got it. Come on. Perfect. Nice. Always a modification. Always a way to increase the intensity. You decide what that is. Perfect. Even if you just roll back two inches and come up, it's simply about making this core contract and stabilize. Let's go. Beautiful. Ah, we have 15 seconds. Woo! Right there. Lift. Four, three, two, and one. Woo! Yeah. Woo. Nice job, you guys. Take it all the way back right there. Just cross that leg over. Open that hip up. Beautiful. You got it right there. Hope that you can take the time just a few minutes and stretch. If you're done, if you have to run, just make sure you stretch that body out right up and over to the other side open that hip up perfect breathing into it shoulders on the floor beautiful you got it right there hug those knees into your chest we're going to roll it all the way up thank you so much for joining us today those hands come forward stretch back we love feedback so let us know your feedback on this length of this video it's about a full 60 minute workout. Perfect. We have lots of other workouts on our channel here. 15 minutes, 20 minutes, 30 minutes. Let us know what you like. Let us know what you're looking for. We're here for you. Beautiful. Push those hips right down to the floor. Get a nice stretch to that hip flexor. We're going to curl those toes under. We're going to lift our hips right up to the ceiling. 
walk your hands back, get a nice stretch through those hamstrings. Let that upper body hang. Beautiful. We're just going to take one hand over and we're going to open ourselves up to the ceiling. Now, why I'm in this position, I am squeezing my shoulder blades together behind me. You got it. And then right up and over to the other side. Beautiful. Release it center. We're going to come to the front of the thighs. We're going to roll it all the way up. Roll your shoulders down. Take those hands up behind right here. We did a lot of work for that waist today for sure. So we're just going to reach up. You saw this in the warm up. You see it here at the end. Yes. And up and over to the other side. Nice. Yeah. Be good to yourself, team. Bring it center. Give yourself a nice deep inhale up. Hands come together at the top. We're going to exhale down, drop all the way down. Get that stretch through the hips. Right there. Breathe in. Feel the stretch through the lower back. Take a nice deep inhale. Exhale, rise up. One more dive down to the floor. And we are done for the day. Right here, bring it up. Those hands come together at the top. Exhale down. Woo! Yes! High five to you guys right there. Well done. Until next time, send us your feedback. We'd love to hear it. Enjoy your day. Have a great day, guys.